go through them really hefty, aren't they? <laughs> it's sunglasses in here. Yeah, it's the right, <laughs> Welcome to Oldley Edge in Cheshire. Today we're going to be taking you inside this detached contemporary marvel behind me. It looks pretty wonderful. Now it's made up of red brick, black wood painted for that cladding and then we've got all the black frames as well as tons of glazing creating a really nice bright space inside. It's got five bedrooms, five bathrooms, over 3,000 square feet of interior space and has even won awards for its architecture. So we're going to be showing you inside today, breaking down a full tour. It's listed with Jordan Fishwick for 1.895 million. We've got electric gates at the front of the property leading you onto your brand new resin set driveway with some nice paving around the edges. We've got these sleeper lines here creating some nice landscaping. Yeah, we've got really mature trees around the property as well. Yeah. So you are really immersed in that nature. Like I said, that red brick build looks really nice at the moment, especially with all the lights on. Mm -hmm. Really contemporary, very striking from the front. We've got a double car garage here. Up above, you can see your terraced area with the glass balustrades. But yeah, I think we should just head in, Jazz. Let's go. Entering the property, we have this really nice light filled entrance hall. We've got a study to my right, along with a bathroom and access through to the garage. Plenty of storage, but let's pop a floor plan up right now so you guys can understand the layout of the property. So we're gonna head through this way first. We've got the herringbone flooring and that light wood. You'll see all of the dark frames throughout the property as well as the dark furnishings, niches and radiators and stuff as well. Yeah, I love this artwork, Tom. I was about Sorry. to say, this is my reaction to the, the artwork in this house. Mind blown. <laughs> let's go through into the kitchen. So it's again, really bright in here. We've got the pitch of the roof really making the most of all the natural light that can come in. We've got Corian worktops in this horseshoe shape coming all the way around. Really nice and bright, great contrast. Yeah, so wide as well. Yes, exactly. Yeah, really, really hefty, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> Bespoke cabinetry all the way around. I like how I've got that two-tone color scheme. Mm -hmm. and it's actually a somatic kitchen, so we've got some nice assorted drawers and stuff. Very bespoke, like I said. We've got the Miele appliances throughout, so we've got the induction hob here and then the two ovens this side. Mm. We have the boiling tap here, perfectly placed next to this drawer for the mugs, so you can make yourself a brew. <laughs> Perfect. We have the freezer this side next to the oven, so that's nice and convenient. Yeah. And this light as well, it's like origami almost. Cool, doesn't it? Second it. Right, and then we've got a pantry through here, nice and tucked away so you can keep your microwave, toaster and bits out of everyone's line of sight. Yeah, and then the fridge is next to that. Yes, exactly, we've got the fridge there. Great stuff. We've got this wood flooring again, but not in that herringbone shape. The breakfast bar hangs off of this Corian worktop with the glass top as well, so nice, easy to clean. Yes. A little bit separate, but still on that kitchen space. And then we have a little heater underneath as well, keeping your feet toasty. <laughs> Double aspect window behind Jazz, loads of light flooding in through here. We even have a light well here so that the, the light from outside yeah. can be fed through into that, that corridor. Yeah. Really cool. Now, this fireplace is pretty sweet as well. I like how the lights actually kind of dance and glisten off these crystals that are yeah, set inside. Yeah, it looks cool. And the TV's actually recessed into here as well. All very bespoke. This is a nice space here. I like the coffee table in the middle as well. Yeah, definitely. Nice, for, nice summer lounge because it's yes. very open. We've got loads of light, bi-folding doors here. You can head out into the terrace, but we do have a cover there as well. So yeah, all year round, out there. Yeah, all year round you can use that. We've got glass balustrades as well so that your drive is unobstructed. Composite decking as well, which is yes. good. Yes, yeah, obviously that rots less quickly than wood. So yes. yeah, good for longevity. Let's come through here, Jazz. Ooh, we're exploring. So we've got a dining table here. Perfect again for the summer because we've got access out to the garden here and then access out to the terrace. That side mm -hmm. flows really nicely and we have flagstone flooring all over that terrace outside. Yeah, it looks good. And the AstroTurf. Yeah, really easy to maintain. Yeah, I like the little touches of glass throughout because it really magnifies how much glazing there actually yes. is throughout here. Absolutely. Now this is a bit more snug in here as a lounge space. Perfect spot to sit and enjoy some TV or a movie in the evening. We've got the soft rug underneath us yeah. so it feels nice and cozy. TV again, and another fireplace. Yeah, it looks stunning. All right, let's go this way, Jazz. So opposite me now, we have storage underneath the stairs. And then we flow around here. We've got a bathroom, really covered in marble in here. Nice and bright space. Wow. Got a freestanding bath swooping down. And then we have the shower in there as well. Frosted glass windows for privacy and the basin. But it's actually kind of acts as a Jack and Jill, so you can head through to the bedroom through here. So you could use that bathroom without disturbing the person in here, or it could act as an ensuite, whatever yeah. you preferred. Then we have bifolding doors here, 
that access that garden space and it really wraps around the whole back of the property yeah great entertaining garden definitely yeah okay and then we go through here just we have a utility space in here nice and tucked away and then opposite us we have another bedroom currently been used as a study space but it would make a great extra bedroom ample yeah. size for a double bed in here and then again with access out to the to the garden we've got an ensuite in here with the stone tiles all the way around Ooh, I like a nice that. change isn't it a bit more mediterranean right let's go check out the bedrooms upstairs jess i'll take you up there let's do it so coming up onto the second floor we have the gray carpet and we also have lights up the stairs but i'm going to take you through into this principal suite look how much room we have in here we have the double height vaulted ceiling as well velux windows on either side so you've just got light flooding in literally at every angle we've got this floor to ceiling window here looking incredible and fitting the pitch of the roof but we also have more windows here huh. what are you looking out to i am looking at that window thinking it's a mirror but it's actually a window <laughs> is what's happening right now. Jeez. We have bespoke cabinetry all throughout here. You can see here it's really fit to the space, really yes. utilizing every corner that they have. On the suite through here. Need sunglasses in here. So it's bright. so bright. You've got all the whites so any light that does come in through here from the Velux windows, just reflected at every angle. And then you've got the nice bright lights here freestanding bath here, marble all the way throughout, and a really nice walk-in shower that has these spotlights at the bottom. We've got underfloor heating in the bathrooms as well throughout oh, yeah. the property, yeah. And then we've got storage in these cupboards. You can actually just walk in here, it's very yeah, spacious. Yeah, it would act as like oh. a walk-in wardrobe almost. Yeah. But in addition to the storage there, if we come back out, we have another similar style storage in here. Look, Tom, the automatic lights come on. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a lot bigger than you'd think for like a hallway cupboard. Yeah, I love the storage. Whoa. Very Spot bright. <laughs> Close them up. I like the doors with the kind of recesses throughout yeah. all the doors in the Very smart. Room. Right, next, well, final bedroom, I should say, another great spacious one, the vaulted ceilings again. I can't go over these Velux windows on both sides. I just think it looks so symmetrical. Which makes it feel so much bigger. And considering it's such a rainy, dull day today. Yeah, imagine what it's like no in the summer. there's no sun in the sky. Yeah. Exactly, in the summer it'd be incredible. So yeah, another great size room in here. And then we have this really stunning ensuite. So we have the floor to ceiling window here that's frosted. And yeah, I love the tiles in here. You've got more like polished stone that go all the way around. Sandy the, tones. Yeah, vaulted ceiling continues. Got a ladder. <laughs> <laughs> and then you also have this frosted section on your frameless glass screen. So, you know, if someone's washing their hands out and you're in the shower, they can't oh, yeah. see you. See your <laughs> nether regions. <laughs> and yeah, we've got some, I, yeah, these spotlights in the wall are such a good idea. Great touch, right? Definitely. Yeah, a nice bit of storage in here too. Let's head back out into the hallway, Tom. We're in a really highly sought after area here in Audley Edge. We've got the train station only 0.7 miles away and Manchester International Airport only 15 minutes away. We are surrounded by some lovely boutiques, shops and restaurants. And yeah, just a really lovely road as well. It's a private road, so you're really safe and secluded. But we hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a like and subscribe. We want to know your favourite part, so leave that down below in the comments. And this is actually the second to last tour we are bringing you guys Vlogmas. So, big thumbs up, please. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Bye.